Hello everyone, welcome to Infigyan in this very exciting video of algebraic challenging equations and expressions where we are going to solve two math olympiad problems today. First one is square root x equal to square root of square root 2 minus 1 over square root of square root 2. This is given. We have to find the value or we have to simplify the value of this expression x plus 2 plus square root x square plus 4x over x plus 2 minus square root of x square plus 4x. So let's get started. I will solve this problem by considering first this term as a. So this will also be a. So our given equation which is in square root x that I, I can write square root a minus 1 over square root a. Now I will take the help of squaring. Okay, let's do squaring both sides. So this time this side I will get x square root of whole square. So that would be free of square root. RHS will have a square that means a second square. So I will write plus 1 over a minus 2ab. So that ab will get 1. So minus 2. If I will add both sides 2, then I will be having x plus 2 equal to a plus 1 over a. Here I have used the identity a minus b whole square, which is a square plus b square minus 2ab. And in next step, I will use one more identity, which is a plus b whole square. The difference is only the sign it would be twice plus twice a b. Now come to our expression, this expression which we have to finally solve, simplify. Okay, let me write here x plus 2 plus square root of x square. I am going to add and subtract 4. Done. Numerator and similarly for denominator also. I will write x plus 2 minus square root of x square plus 4x plus 4 minus 4. Now see, if I will write x plus 2 whole square, then I can write x square plus 4x plus 4. So that term is written. You can use this identity. So for this expression value I will write x plus 2 whole square. So let me write it x plus 2 plus square root of x plus 2 whole square minus 4 divided by x plus 2 minus square root of x plus 2 whole square minus 4. Up to this point it is okay. Now see what is x plus 2. x plus 2 is a plus 1 over a and a is if you see square root 2. We will use that last. Okay. So let me write in that place x plus 2 whole square that means a square plus 1 over a square plus 2. So I am going to put the value of x plus 2 in this expression. Okay. So let's put this value. I will write a plus 1 over a plus square root of x plus 2 whole square. I am writing directly a square plus 1 over a square plus 2 minus 4. Similarly, we will write in the denominator a plus 1 over a minus square root of a square plus 1 over a square minus plus 2 minus 4. Same thing, unchanged. Okay. Now see, if I will take away 2 minus 4, then it will become minus 2. This is the only change. So let me write this expression again. a plus 1 by a plus let me write 
ए स्क्वायर प्लस वन ओवर ए स्क्वायर माइनस टू ओके डिवाइडेड बाई ए प्लस वन बाई ए माइनस सेम थिंग ए स्क्वायर प्लस वन बाई ए स्क्वायर माइनस टू Now you know that a square plus one by a square minus two is a minus one by a whole square. So in next step we can write a plus one over a plus under the root a minus one over a whole square. And in denominator also same thing one over a minus a square root of a minus one over a whole a square. This is how. i will write now square and square root will be over so i will be writing a plus 1 by a this value will be this is square root and square term i will cancel from the numerator denominator so i will write a minus 1 by a in the numerator and a plus 1 by a minus a plus 1 by a in the denominator now c Which term is going to cancel and what is left after that? So after that, I am getting two a over two over a. So I can cancel this. This will give us a square. Final result is a square. What was our a? A was square root two. This was our substitution. So our answer becomes root two square. That means two. this is our answer now let us solve the second problem this one is see it is more tricky x is equal to cube root of 4 plus cube root of 2 plus 1 this is given to us and we have to find the expression value 6 over x plus 6 over x square plus 2 over x cube this value okay so how we will proceed how we can think Take away one from both sides, so x minus one will become four cube root of. Let me write in that manner itself. Cube root of two. Now I am going to consider cube root because of it is cube root involved. So I will use cube both sides this way. Now one formula is about to come, which is a minus b whole cube. This is one identity. Which we know, a cube minus b cube minus three ab in bracket a minus b. This is what we know. So let's apply. So I will get x cube minus one minus three x and bracket x minus one using this identity algebraic identity. Okay, and R H S would be. A plus B whole cube. Let me write that identity also. A plus B whole cube. A cube plus B cube plus three AB. A plus B. This is what we know. Let's apply A cube so four, B cube so two, plus three AB so three. Let me write cube root of eight. Because four power one over three times two power one over three, so four times two. Because exponent is same, we will multiply the base. So eight power one over three, or cube root eight. In bracket, I will write cube root four, which is x minus one. So let me write completely first. In next step, I would write this is x minus one. Okay. So what is there? Six plus three times cube root of eight. It is eight power one over three, which is two power three into one over three by by the exponent property. So this value will come out two. So two times three. So I will write here six. If I will expand this side, then it will become six plus six x minus six. Or overall right hand side is six x. Now come to LHS. LHS is x cube minus three x square. This term plus three x minus one. Up to this point, 
except algebraic identities, we haven't used anything. Now take all the terms to left. Right hand side is 6x only and left hand side we have 4 terms. So if I will write all the terms to left hand side, x cube minus 3x square minus 3x minus 1 equal to 0. Okay. Now what I will do here, I will divide this equation. As you can say, see that we have to find out 6 over x plus 6 over x square plus 2 over x cube, this value. So if I will divide this expression by x, x cannot be directly, you cannot substitute here x equal to 0 at it is making our denominator 0. So that value will be infinity. So what I am going to do, I will divide this expression by x cube by considering x is not equal to 0. As you can see, x is not equal to 0. So let me divide directly. I will write x cube, x cube, x cube and x cube. Okay. So if you will check, then it will become 1 minus let me write 3 over x minus 3 over x square minus 1 over x cube equal to 0. Okay. Now check what is asked 6 over x plus 6 over x square plus 2 over x cube. Here it is not matching. So what we can write here, it is actually 2 times the same thing. 3 over x plus 3 over x square plus 1 over x cube. And our value is, let me write that value, 3 over x from this equation plus 3 over x square plus 1. I am taking this term towards right. 1 over x cube, that value is 1 from this equation. Now we have to put here that value. So our answer, let me, let me write this value here. This value is 1. So our RHS would be 2 times 1. So value is 2. Okay. I hope you like this video. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye-bye till next video. I hope these problems of Math Olympiad will work for you. Thank you so much.